Hello guys, uh, welcome to today's lecture. Uh, let's go through the slides where we have stopped. Yeah, we have uh, written this code. Oh, uh, today let's talk about the quadratic equation. For example, in algebra we were using, uh, we were going to write y is equal to ax squared plus bx plus c. But in C++, uh, we can also use uh, some built-in functions like pow, p-o-w, which is power function. Or we can, uh, but here, uh, let's just write it very simple. y is equals a multiplied by x multiplied by x plus b multiplied by x plus c. Let's just make a, a small program for this. Uh, so... Let me just remove this one. Uh, yeah, we had a, b, and b, x, and c. We had four variables here. Uh, for each of them, I can give a value here. a is equals to 10, b is equals to 3, and x is equals to 4, c is equals to 20. This one. I have the value of a, b, and x, and c. I just want to show the output of y, which is equals to y is equals to a multiplied by x multiplied by x plus b multiplied by x plus c. This is our equation. And what will be the output? Let's just try to see out equals to y let's just display y so let's just run it compile and run yeah 192 192 is the result uh, i'm going to write a program which takes the uh, input uh, from the user only takes a b and c and it will give you the x value what will be the x1 and x2 value uh, so here we will use uh, we will we should uh, use the built-in functions just like uh, power pow so guys first i need to include the uh, mat header file hash include mat dot h then here uh, I have a, b, c, and x, uh, x1 and x2. a, comma b, comma c, comma x1, comma x2. These are my variables, and I'm going to uh, show for the user that enter a, comma b, comma c values and backslash n in the next line so cn will take the value of a then value of b then value of c in separate lines here i just used uh, cn once and uh, just by this operator i can say which one value will be first first i will take the value a then take the value b and take the value c then after doing this we are going to use some functions First, we have to if we use the Muhammad bin Musa Khwarezmi equation, uh, we need to use delta. So I need to have delta function. I want to guess that it should be good because we are going to have maybe point uh, numbers. Here I'm going to use another function delta. Delta is equals to what? Delta is equals to b square. When is b square? We can use just b multiply by b minus 4 a 4 multiplied by a multiplied by c this is the delta equa uh, equation then uh, we have the delta formula and now for x1 x1 is equals to minus b minus b plus plus sqrt this is a function which is used to find the square root of Square root of what? Delta. Square root of delta. All divided by 2L. This is our 
formula for x1 and for x2 we only have to change the sign which will be minus sign so then we are going to show the results see out x1 is equals to what further i'm going to show x1 then backslash t backslash t or backslash it means tap it will uh, put eight space so after that we are going to show x2 is equals to and then x2 will this is our result and we can also use endl endl is also uh, same as backslash and backslash is used inside double quotation but and l is used in uh, outside the double quotation so let's run this let's see if there was any problem or not so there was no error and successfully ran enter a b c values let's, ha let's have a big equation of uh, uh, one x uh, one x x square which is a is equals to one mm, minus 3x minus 3x plus 2 if you solve it the result will be uh, 1 and 2 1 multiplied by 2 will be 2 and minus 1 my um, 1 minus 1 minus 3 yeah yeah the x1 is equal to 2 and x2 is equal to 1 the result is shown you can also uh, put any other values the result will be shown but here uh, we had some options if delta was uh, greater if, if uh, sorry if delta was greater than equals to zero it means there is uh, there is uh, there is there is uh, the reason uh, there is uh, answer if uh, delta was equals to zero it means x1 is equal to or so let's let's try this one yeah oh i think we have to use f else so uh, it's okay after a few days when we wanted to uh, teach the f and if else i will show you how to complete this program so guys this was our uh, today's lecture we only made uh, the uh, simple program for finding the x1 and x2 of uh, quadratic equation so guys see you in the next lecture